and welcome to Furry Is Well, where we are back on the Sky Factory, and I've just been topping up my Ender Ghoul because we used up so much of the damn stuff. Uh, I've just reset the game as well, so the the Nether Quartz is now going up rather than going down, which is a good good thing because damn, we were running low on that stuff. Uh, we've got over a stack, so we'll just take that upstairs and shove that in the machine, get that processing out. Uh, today we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna be doing some stuff as per usual. As per usual, we join the game to do stuff. Uh, that's still got... Okay, that's fine. You can have that. There you go. I knew you wanted it. I knew you wanted it. And now you've got it. Excellent. Uh, we're going we're gonna to be heading into the nether. To Not the nether. The, the, we're going to make some stuff. I, I, I'm just rambling a little bit now, trying to remember what it is we're going to do. We're going to make something. We're going to make something. We're going to start making something. That's what we're going to do. We are going to make a... Stand an armor stand. That's what we're going to do first. Stone slabs is three. St I've got. Think I've got enough stuff to do that. Yes, I have. Douche, douche, douche. I've got six stone slabs there and some iron. I think we've got iron. Douche, douche. Excellent. And that should make us an armor stand. And the purpose of the armor stand is so I have somewhere to put my armor. Because I don't want to be running around in expensive diamond armor all the time. Because I'm an idiot and I lose it. Now apparently with the armor stand, if you click on it when you're wearing a full set of armor, you will swap the armor you're wearing for the armor that's on the armor stand. That's my understanding. I may be wrong on this point, but that's my understanding. So we're going to have the armor stand kind of like there-ish. Next to our elevator, so we can we can just uh, choo -choo. no choo choo no choo choo. Did we not fill that in? We may not have filled that in. Fair enough. I thought we'd filled that in. Eh, eh. What can I? What do I care? What do I care? So we'll make some diamond armor now. We've got some diamonds. We've got we got ten diamond diamond bits so we, we, it's starting to increase the, the the rate of I do love those colors they're very bright and vociferous they make me very very happy um, diamond armor diamond diamonds 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 there they are so we want douche 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 diamond britches and then we want douche douche diamond helmet and then we want douche 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 I've done all this before, but we, we lost it because I'm an idiot. That's why I'm building the, the, the armor stand, so that we've got it, and it's permanently with us. Because, damn, this is expensive on the diamond front. And let's make some iron armor while we're here. So we've got that too. It's going to be a bit more fun making these recipes, because there's a lot of iron in our system. And we need booties. We'll have them. And we need... What haven't we got? The chest piece. The chest plate to make make us secure in the heart region. Because you've got to be secure in the heart region. Everyone knows you need to be secure in the heart region. Uh, right, okay, cool. We've got armour. We've got two sets of armour. We'll put the iron armour on. Because we can. Because we, 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 we are at some point going to have to head back into the old friend, the deep dark. I don't want to go. I don't want to go in there. It's dangerous in there, but we've got to snatch that, that construction out of the deep dark. Which means we need to we need a bit of time in there to do some building. So if we put all this lot in here. And we are currently, if I do F5, wearing iron armor. Excellent. So if I is it shift click on that, there we go, and now I am wearing diamond armor. Excellent, so that works. So we can switch between armors quite easily there. There's probably a way to switch the whole outfit, I don't know definitively. That needs a bit of oiling, that armor needs some oiling. So now we've got, we've got, we've got our, our whole armor arrangement sorted out, nicely done. Uh, we need to look at everything everything needs looking at now um, am I going to be able to connect everything directly to everything let's make let's make an ender chest 
Do we need blaze rods? Uh, did we chew up all the blaze rods? We probably did chew up all the blaze rods. We can go and make some more. Carefully this time. We can go and make some more blaze rods. Uh, we're going to need probably eight blaze rods. So we'll just turn that on. Wait patiently. And... Ow. Turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it off. Off. God damn it. Again. Wow. These things are just monsters. Honestly. I definitely need to get the grinder on that. I really do think this is getting ridiculous. I'm just, just suiciding every damn time now. Honestly. I was, want I was wanting one and he spawned in right on top of me, punched me and that was that. Jeez Louise. I just... Clear the mess out again. There's another one. There we go. Got them all. Okay, cool. Right, let's try that again. This time, hopefully he won't spawn right on top of us and punch us in the face. Switches on. They spawn so quickly when they get going. There he is. He's down. Excellent. We got three anyway. Let's get another one. I don't like the way he spawns right on top of you. But at least you get a visual indication of when it's spawned. Two. Two of them. Really, guys? Have some water. Sons of bitches. Honest to God. Get dead. Everyone get dead. What? 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 Why? Why? Oh, uh, water. It was pushing me into the water. Wow. I need two more. Yeah, I definitely need to get a, a grinder on this. This is just... This is just stupid game. Where's my bucket of water? Need that somewhere handy. I tried to turn that off. I did click the off and it just didn't. Up is on. Right. Let's get this right this time. There we go. That's off. One more blaze rod needed. And then we should be good to go. One more. Once more unto the breach, dear friends. Where are you? Okay, right on top of me. Nice. Just knocked the torch off the wall as well. That's not good. Uh, torch back. And oh, the fire. Fire's gone out. Okay, fine. Yeah, we're going to get a grinder on that. We're going to make the room a little smaller, get a grinder in there, get the job done right. Because that is damn dangerous. And I do not approve of damn dangerous. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I think. That can go away. Um, so let me let me quickly check out what it is for an ender chest. Ender chest. G H E S T. The ender chest. This job. Uh, two obsidian, an ender pearl, and some wool, and a chest. We should be able to get a chest easy enough. We need two. Ooh, let me just check. Ender pouch. What is the ender pouch? P O U C H. That is leather. Okay, so we only need the one chest. It's not unreasonable. I don't mind. I don't mind too much. It's not not an unreasonable recipe. So we've got wooden chest. Blaze rods we've got. We need wool. And we need an ender pearl. Ender pearls? None. Okay. I think I've been grinding a lot of ender pearls uh, into, my, into my goo, goo machine. So uh, not got that many. Uh, I'll have one, please, begin. And that will make me four. Excellent. I thought that might be the case. Minimums, don't you know? Minimums. Minimums and maximums. I'm going to have to peel the cows as well, I think. Uh, we want ender. This jobby. Ender.io is interesting. I need to, I really need to get a bit more 
bit more in the know about the Ender IO. We've got wool. We've got wool. Okay, that's good. Uh, shift click that in. Get that. Okay, we've got some leather. We should have tons of the stuff. Three of them. Okay, and if we can Ender Pouch. Ouchy Pouchy. Yep, that's what we want. Shift click that in. Oh, the blaze, blaze. It's not blaze rods, it's blaze powder. That's good. That's a good thing. You can have them. Because I don't need them. I can get blaze powders from over here. I have a system for making blaze powders. Obtaining them, dirt cheap. So, I'm happy enough to use them. Rather than burn blaze rods up. Because they're quite expensive to... I asked for four. Why is it giving me three? Damn lag. Damn lag. Damn lag. That's all I've got to say on the matter. Damn lag. It, it frustrates and vexes me at every possible turn. My brain just cannot cope with the damn lag. There we go. Uh, I think this is the only end of storage system we've got. So, if I chucky chucky chest down somewhere, maybe there, and I grab out of here all my snaffle tools, so that, 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 and that, and I put them in there. Uh, that, 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 that. Spare sword can go in there. Why not? Is that all? All the tools? I think that's all the tools we need in there. And then if we open our ND pouch, which we have handy on our toolbar next to our torches, which are also going to be on our toolbar there, and we open that, is all tall. Yay! Perfect. Excellent. So we've got a extra space in our inventory where we're not storing crap that's good let's just let's just have a tidy of the old inventory here they can go they can go oh, the arrows can go I don't know I don't know about it. the obsidian can go the wool I'll probably keep the ladder can go slabs can go slabs can go glass probably keep probably a keeper of the glass keeper to glass keeper to glass it's only six Wool can stay, definitely wool can stay. Probably should go in that chest, but that chest is a little bit full right now. Just just, just a little bit full. So we need to make some of these spatial pylons. Let's see what these look like if I put them down. Spatial pylon, spatial pylon. Okie dokie. Interesting. And hop up, spatial pylon. And then if we have another one over, say, boo -boo 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 here, like that. And then if we hook them together with some of the ME cable, which we've got none of. Where's the ME cable? We might still be in the machine of my bob. I thought we'd made. I thought we actually got some ME cable out. 63. That's probably not going to be enough. Where did we put the ME cable then? I thought we pulled some out of there last episode. Oh, we did that. That might be enough. Nearly two stacks of the stuff. So if I connect this, I ruined the oot side, like so, and then attach this thing to it, spatial I.O. port, kind of there-ish. That doesn't work. Why doesn't that work? I thought you only had to bound the two corners. And that's bounded the two corners. So why that no worky? Hmm. Interesting. This could be very expensive if I have to bound more than just the two edges. They're linked together. Do I have to do this? Oh no, that's not. it's not happy with that, is it? It's not happy with that. Can we break that off? Yeah, we can. Okay. It didn't like that. Um, yeah, it's not happy with that. If I put the card in, does that, does that make a difference? If I pop him in there. No. Right. Excellent news. That's gone well. Do I need to attach this directly to... No, surely you must be able to get away with, with just that. Let's try. If I place uh, wood atop this, kind of there-ish, and then 
spatial pylon along there to bound that much and then hook that up as well are you gonna are you gonna hook up does that do anything yet no hmm this stuff is interesting I I've seen it done with just this column and this column I'm sure I have but why doesn't that work I don't get why that doesn't work Hmm. I'm sure that should be right. I don't need to do this as well, do I? Is that too much? That's one too much, I think. We're only taking a very small region there. So if I just bring this ME cable around the corner and up to there that might do the job and then again it might not uh, torch related issue there so that, that's still not they're still not happy it's still not happy with the arrangement I don't get it I do not get it that should bound a region perfectly why doesn't it well, I guess we're gonna have to look at these in more detail because my original plan was simply quite simply just to, to have a column of these either side of the, uh, the the base thing that we're trying to pull out and, and then that would hook everything up and everything would be wizard and kablawi but apparently that is not enough so I need to have a good old thinker dink about it all now but I need to I need to build those verticals in in the deep dark anyway I might do that off camera because it's gonna be boring and it's gonna be painful and it's going to be aggravating we can go and get it started but generally I think the whole building process will be off camera take that and get a tesseract as well where's the te let's get loads of these buggers loads of these spatial IOs and that actually we could put the spatial IOs in here that way we don't have to have everything in our inventory. That way if we die, we haven't got to do a corpse run to go and get it all back. Because that would depress me. That would depress the G-Willikers out of me. Power. Power from this thing. This is our power. This, this hooks directly up to that massive storage cell upstairs. And that's just going to slam so much power into our system that it's it, it, just, it just can't cope. It will be staggering the amount of power we're going to slam into the system. I don't know why I've got clay in there. I did do something earlier, but I can't remember what. I don't know why I've got this leaf here either. Duskberry bush. Uh, is there something in there? No. Why are you here? I don't want you. You can go in there. And you can go in there. And you can go in there. I don't know why these things are coming out. I guess it's there's nothing in there. So why didn't it go in there? Has that got a filter on it? Nope. Okay. Fair enough. Let's head to the deep dark. See if we can see if we can get some stuff started. We're getting we're getting on towards the end of the episode anyway, so we'll just we'll just get in and get started, and then and then bail, probably. Okay, let's head on down. Head on down, 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 down. See, with the white, 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 we don't need anything else. There's all our stuff, all our all our fabulous stuff. Uh, hopefully, it's going to be nice and peaceful in here. Seriously doubt it, but you never know. You never know your luck. It might be peaceful. It might be peaceful. It won't be peaceful, but it might be peaceful. Get that there. So we've got our stack of cobble ready because we're going to need that because we're going to need to do a bit of nerd polling and hoping we don't get skeletoned off the nerd pole because that's as good as our armor. Okay, guys. Okay. Right. All the locals are very unfriendly. Let's just get over here and get this job started. Let's get a bit of sprint on. Get to this corner. This is where we're going to build our first doings with these things.
get up into the air. Hopefully not die. A few critters around, but that's fine. As long as it's not skeleton critters. And we are getting into the dark here, so that's that's not necessarily good. I think that's high enough. I think that's high enough. Out, we're in the dark. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta move. If he touches me, I'm dead. Right, he's down. Let's eat something. Get our health back. So that's one of the, 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 the mighty towers of stuff. There's a lot of bad things in here. A lot of very bad things. But we can just sneak around the outside. We're safe on this thing. I'm not going to explore it until I've pulled it into the overworld. I'm just not healing quickly here. I'm just going to hide in this corner till I've healed. Right, um, I think I think we're, we're close to signing off point. So, I'm just going to say, for now, from Furry Ears World, where everything's a little bit terrifying, ta-ta, for now.